Oh, welcome to Fabrics on the Leader Stand at CCW. And what we've got here at the moment is a revolutionary new rasterizer range. It's called the RX range, and you can see it in the background here. Uh, comprises of three different units. The RX 2000, which has got this integral two screens in it. You've got two rasterizers, the RX 2000, uh, 1000 and the RX 500. What's key about them is that they all support what you can see here, which is an HDMI or an SDI output. And that's a staggering uh, 1920 by 1080 real estate. So a massive amount of area to put to your, uh, your instruments in. And what you're looking at here is a very beautiful GUI, very easy to use. Um, the colors denote the amount of inputs. And as you can see, there are eight inputs available on this RX range. The RX 500 is slightly smaller, that's four. But all of the inputs are simultaneous. That's quite significant. But what's key to it, and if I quickly demonstrate it, it's a uh, mouse control to the screen here. I'm going to close down all the windows. And if you want to define the working space as an engineer, you simply go in, select from the drop down or the pull up, I should say, uh, pictures, waveforms, vector scopes, whichever you want. And you can build uh, any particular um, design template that suits the uh, application that you've got in your studio. They are obviously editable, so you can change the scale of it. But what's key is if you put the time in initially, you can set a load of presets. So say I set a preset for video, signals, maybe audio. Um, I can go literally to my presets, and this will uh, enable me to save up to 99 in this bar here. Uh, this is one I built earlier for the show. And if I double click on it, you can see it's brought back all of the information. So here you have uh, in orange, this is one particular channel showing picture, waveform, vector scope, and here we have a different channel. Of course, hiding behind here, or not at the moment, you can see vector, you can see a generator as well as part of the module. Uh, but if I select the little icon here, I can bring the picture to the front. What's good about this is that if you're in a shading situation uh, within a truck maybe, then what, what you want to see most of the time is that the actual picture. But what if there is a fault? You need to get to the instruments pretty quickly to find out what's going wrong. And so you would literally deselect it and reveal the instruments behind. Now from the point of view of how you purchase this unit, you can buy it, see if I can turn this so you can see the back, this particular unit. Uh, you can see uh, the modules uh, that uh, comprise each of the units. And um, effectively, this one takes two units, which gives you the four inputs. The other two, the larger ones here, take four modules. And of the choice you've got at the moment, you've got um, dual inputs on one module. You can select uh, an analyzer or a generator combined board, or you can do uh, an analyzer with eye technology, or an analyzer generator with eye technology. So a significant amount of tool sets in the one unit. And that's not all, because we support optical as well as part of the standard uh, um, configuration on all of these units. The thing to look towards the future with our units is support for ASI and looking forward to full Dolby Decode. And let's not uh, underestimate the audio support that is present on these particular units. Here you have audio metering and you've obviously got phase metering at the bottom. So uh, an awful lot of stuff in, um, in an excellent box. Obviously, check out the pricing with Marketech. I think that will, be, uh, that will make you smile as well. Okay, thank you very much.